Hello Capricorn, welcome to your March 2023 Tarot Podcast brought to you by me, Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queen's East Yorkshire Tarot and Five Tarot. This month you've been brought the Justice Reversed card. And in general, it can mean that you're feeling currently as though something's happening in your life is particularly unjust, and you may well be correct. However, there may not be a great deal that you can do about it at the moment. And it's important for you to accept the reality of that and don't let it grind you down too much. And when it comes up at work, it's suggesting that you may be indeed being treated unfairly in your workplace. However, there may not be a great deal in which you can do to change this in the short term. Think critically and logically about what's happening and do not allow emotion to make you cut your nose off to spite your face. Even when reversed, this card carries the warning that you need to be ensured that your work-life balance is where it needs to be. Too much emphasis on either aspect of life throws that other into imbalance and seek the best advice you can before making any major changes. Yes, things may be unjust. However, the solution may look be of a longer term that simply leaving or creating confrontation about it is not going to work for you at the moment so slow down in terms of love it can be very important for you to look carefully at exactly what you are bringing about in that relationship you may feel as if you've been treated unfairly when this card appears however it's important to bear in mind that such things rarely come about in a vacuum have you possibly contributed to the current situation of those difficulties? When you draw this card in reverse and you're looking for love, how that may come through to you is really are you ready for a long term loving relationship? Because there may be ways in which you're standing in your own way to prevent love coming to you. For example, if you're too eager to make changes in your own life in order to fit with that person, you may in fact need to develop stronger boundaries and stronger sense of self before a true loving long-term relationship will come about for you. Financially, when it comes around you, be cautious and prudent with your money and see to it, particularly when you're dealing with cash, that you're careful where you put it and no one has access to it. And if you're waiting on an answer to a financial issue and questions that must come from someone else, unfortunately, you're going to have to wait a little bit longer. You know, they've got the message, but they just have to wait. So that's all from me. Until the next time, I'm Kathleen Robinson. Yeah.